Hey, welcome back to the Ping Pong Flick Show. My name is Chris Wong. A lot of people have been telling me to check out this article. And so I said, you know what? Let me address it. Um, as I've not seen much people talk about it, but there are a certain amount of people that are concerned about this. This is coming from... An, uh, a site that I've not really heard about called GiantFreakingRobot.com and it says this we're going to see a different version of Wonder Woman in the Flash interesting well what did it have to say so this is an article by Faith McKay for a while now rumors that Gal Gadot will appear as Wonder Woman in the upcoming The Flash movie have popped up around the internet toward the end of 2020 many outlets came forward with a similar similar claims so it definitely seemed to be something DC was discussing at the very least now, this is actually very true because uh, you know a, a year ago they said that Warner Brothers want Gal Gadot to appear in Annie Muschietti's The Flash the source was the Illuminati which are very reputable and also Daniel Rick also claimed that as well that they were in talks to have her appear in the flash movie and then we also had some other elements where Gal Gadot started following Annie Muschietti, Muschietti, Annie Muschietti following, uh, you know, Gal Gadot, and the, that Gal Gadot actually also recently appeared as confirmed on a casting grid for The Flash. So that seems to be everything's up and up, right? Everything's up and up. But according to this, there's a little bit more uh, about this situation than uh, meets the eye. This would have made sense. Ezra Miller's Flash and Gadot's Wonder Woman have both appeared in other films in the DC Extended Universe. They're pretty much in the same Justice League universe, right? In the Zack Snyder's Justice League. Now, their trusted and proven source has shared something fairly surprising with them. Uh, and when they when they actually pull out the evidence for their trusted, their trust is that Wedding Crashers 2 is happening. So I guess I guess they were right about that. And a proven source um, about Benedict Cumberbatch and one WandaVision. That's weird, but you know, Benedict Cumberbatch, I guess, was going to be in a Wonder, Wonder Vision. I don't know. But we're going to see a different version of Wonder Woman in The Flash. Really? At this point, DC hasn't shared a lot about the plot for The Flash. We know that time travel will be a part of the story. We're expecting to see both Ben Affleck and um, Ezra Miller that, as characters in the DC Extended Universe. It's the same universe where Gal Gadot plays Wonder Woman. But we're going to see a different Wonder Woman. So why is the studio now deciding to cast another actress in the role for the Flash movie? Their source was aware and able to share this puzzling piece of news, but not able to disclose the reason behind it. Now, nah, there is plenty of room for guessing, though, and all of it raises a lot of questions about the future of One Woman in the DC Extended Universe. But you know what? This is interesting because this is a Flash movie. This is a Flash movie where they're going to explore time travel and the multiverse in a sense. If we have a movie that has multiple Batmans, Ben Affleck Batman, Michael Keaton Batman, possibly Christian Bale if he jumps in, and other Bat, I don't know, whatever Batman's going to show up in that one as well, but, and why can't we have more Wonder Woman? So it would make sense, it could, I guess, that Wonder Woman, a Wonder Woman could pop up. I mean, even the sense that maybe, uh, perhaps even Linda Carter could show up in the Michael Keaton Batman universe as Wonder Woman, right? Because there was the longest time we've always wanted to see Michael Keaton's Batman, Christopher Reeve's Superman, and Linda Carter's Wonder Woman, all as, as that is the like the the beginnings of the first right trinity uh you know that never happened there are some cool fan trailers that actually happened but that could maybe maybe they would find a way for have linda carter's wonder woman right but but the thing is they explicitly said that gal gadot not wonder woman will appear in animus gay's flash gal gadot would appear in wonder woman's flash so we go on further and the reason why, why would they need uh, a different, why would they recast Gaudo? Well, according to this article here, it says that recently the internet came down hard on Gal Gadot after a controversial tweet she has refused to take down and this is the tweet right here if you remember. It was a basically talk about Israel and Palestine. Um, 
the, the her tweet about the current political situation between Israel and Palestine did not go down favorably with online commenters. While she chose to shut down comments on her Instagram, it hasn't stopped the ire directed her way. At this point, the actress doesn't seem to be hit hard enough by cancel culture for the studio to decide to recast her, but it's enough to make audiences wonder if it has played into the decision. So that could be a reason why. Um, let's I don't know if that's uh, a truly a true reason why they could recast there's a lot of people um, obviously are saying cancel her for a while after this um, you know message that Gal Gadot put out and they're not happy with it so that could also be one reason why they want to maybe recast Wonder Woman in the flash movie but then you got this you got her recent tweet from one, on the Wonder Woman Day where she said Wonder Woman came out four years ago, changed her life, etc., etc., and she hashtags Wonder Woman 3, ins insinuating that she is still going to be in Wonder Woman 3. So what are we seeing here? What is going on here? Uh, and it, it could just be this source may not have the right details I don't hear anything from anybody else no one has said anything else on this topic per se so let's wait and see if there's anything to really really uh, gather from this new exclusive from the site giantfreakingrobot.com uh, and see where they go from here but like you said is the choice to recast Wonder Woman from the Flash one that's based on the storyline restriction Gal Gadot's schedule or is DC testing water see how audience react to see another actress as Diana Prince I guess we'll just have to wait and see but one thing I think to me in my opinion is that she will definitely be in Wonder Woman 3 anything after that not sure but like anything in the superhero comic book hero universe or whatever there's always going to be a recast at, late, at some point in time Wonder Woman will definitely there will definitely be a new Wonder Woman most likely it will be a reboot and not actually a recast but like a new origin for Wonder Woman as that comes again that could very definitely be likely that we could get a new Wonder Woman uh, going to happen in the future that's almost a given there's always a new Batman there's always a new Superman there's always going to be a new Flash and there's definitely going to be a new Wonder Woman but are we going to see that new Wonder Woman in the Flash? Maybe this is their way, just thinking that they could almost make a new spin-off universe from the Flash movie. We got a new Supergirl. Apparently, Supergirl may get her own movie. We got a new Batgirl in it. A Batgirl's going to get her own movie. Why not Wonder Woman? I guess we'll just have to wait and see. All right. Well, thank you so much for watching. Like I said, if you absolutely love this daily dose of entertainment news and content, please click the like button, hit the subscribe button, ring that notification bell, keep this hot dog light on, and I'll see you next time. Bye.